Hey guys, um, so first of all, we're about to do a hair toner review video, whatever you want to call it. So we're going to use today is Icy White. Can you guys see that? I'm not quite sure if this is a blue base or a purple base, which I'm quite sure is a purple base um, because it's Icy White. And... I opened it up already and I looked at the color and it's white. The cream is white. <coughs> Sorry guys, I was smoking some cannabis right before I started making this video. So, um, of course, I have no makeup on, like always. But um, I wanted to show you guys the color of my hair. What happened. So, the previous video I made before this one was the, the color depositing shampoo video. And... Um, I tried to my best to remove that color that I used from that video. I um, bought the clarifying crystals. Um, I used that on my hair. I used that treatment once. And then I washed my hair in the shower with hot water. The shower was hot. And I washed my hair three times with um, head and shoulders shampoo. And this is what my the results I got now I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you guys the outside um what the color looks like outside because outside lighting looks way way different the true lighting it's the true color of what my hair really looks like i'll show you guys outside so you guys see the golden part of my hair and then down here is more like a platinum blonde color on the bottom part so we're going to use this icy white and see what it does on this golden part of my hair on top see what it does on the golden part and see what it does for this okay obviously purple base doesn't do anything for the golden parts so we're gonna see if it's golden base or not which i'm pretty sure that it is we're gonna see what it does to here and what it does to here so if you guys have golden hair um you're gonna know what this toner does to the, your golden bits by you know because we're gonna put it on right here and if you guys have lighter bits, like a platinum, um, pale yellow, you're going to know what it does because I'm going to put it on the lower parts. Um, not on the back part because the back part's more golden, but like on the front part of my hair, we're going to put it. So we'll be back in a little bit, you guys. I have to show you guys the color what's going on here because the first time I put it on, it was white. It wasn't doing anything. It's been on for about 15 minutes. I'm about to rinse it off. And this is the color it's giving me. It's like a blue base color. Um... So we're about to rinse this out and see what it does. All right, you guys. So I need to show you guys the, the after results. This is the after results, you guys. Outside lighting. Um, as you can tell, that it did, well, I don't know if you guys could tell. It did tone the golden parts, you guys. Oh, we're going to do a side comparison, okay? This is the tone part, non-tone part, okay? And then we're going to get a good look at the parts where um, the lighter parts at where it got darker. So down here, as you can see, as you can see, I don't know if my gut's showing. Okay, down here, as you guys can see, it turned the hair like a silver grayish looking color. I say more like a silver color. You guys can see. And this is like the, the other part where it didn't where it didn't tone. And you guys can also um not also, but the um someone's freaking staring at me. I use the there. 10 volume developer. I never use a 20 or a 30. It's always a 20 volume developer. I mean it's always a 10 volume developer. Um if you guys are curious why I use a 10 volume developer, you guys can go ahead and check out my other toner videos and you'll see why. Because I'm not gonna explain that here because that's for a whole other video. So this is the results of the Icy White, Ion Icy White Toner. That's what it did. And um, I thought it was gonna be, I kinda, well I kinda knew, already knew that it was going. So I I knew it was gonna tone the, the darker parts of my, um, sorry, I'm trying to put my hair up. I already, I already knew it was gonna tone the, um, the, the golden parts when I saw um, the toner in my hair after I started processing 
and after about 15 minutes when I saw my hair start turning like more of a blue color I was like okay it's gonna tone the golden parts and it did um, it's not like a solid strong blue base Maybe it is, I don't know, from what, what I, I'm not even mean a professional, okay? But from what I, when I'm looking, it's not like a real solid blue base where it would really definitely, like, just take the golden and just, like, change it and really tone it. It wasn't like that because, um, 